Anna Gardner. So Many are oblivious to the fact 
that they're a very important part of the main election is voting on propositions that affect your specific community, um, and also voting for smaller positions, such as senators, city council, school board positions, and more, that affect our day-to-day -day life. To be more specific, I wanted to read to you some of the propositions that are going to be on the ballot. And he spoke about a few of them. But I think it's really important to read off what you can actually have a say in, other than some crazy ass people running for president. So one of them is uh, about education. So $9 billion in bonds for education in schools. Voter approval of changes to hospital fee programs. Projects that cost more than $2 billion for elections. Conditions under which legislative bills can be passed. Personal income tax increased on incomes over $250,000. Increase the cigarette tax by $2 a pack. Felons convicted of nonviolent crimes and the trials surrounding those. Bilingual education in public schools. State positions on Citizens United versus Federal Election Commission. Require the use of condoms in pornographic films. Prescription drug price regulations. Repeal the death penalty. Background checks for ammunition purchases. Legalization of marijuana and hemp. The death penalty procedures. And the prohibition on plastic single-use carry-out bags. So there's a lot we have going on here. There's a lot we can impact. There's a lot we have a voice in. Our ancestors have fought their asses off so that we could vote. Why would we not take that opportunity? Why would we not decide to have a voice? Why would we decide not to have a say? So all in all, no matter your age, your race, your gender, your financial status, status or religion, you matter. Your opinion matters, and your vote matters. So get out there and vote. Go to your local post office and register to vote. Get the papers to register and pass them out in your local areas and inspire other people to vote as well. And remember that we even live in a social media prevalent world. So even a Facebook post, a tweet, an Instagram photo can make a difference. You have the power, you have the opportunity to have a say in your own community's issues. So take this incredible opportunity and get out there and